Coach Willie Shear back again with another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to flash the Panerai Android drop onto your Nexus device. Now the installation of this drop is actually pretty simple and I'm going to be doing that on the Nexus 7 2013 but this should also work flawlessly on the Nexus 4, the Nexus 5, the Nexus 6, the original Nexus 7 and the Nexus 9. Now, the new version of the ROM is actually based on Android 5.0.2 Lollipop, so I'm actually pretty excited to try it out. So without any further delay, let's jump right into the video. Now, the prerequisites of the installation process are one, that you need to be rooted, and the second, that you need to be running a custom recovery, and that's pretty much it. Now, once you're actually done with the prerequisites, what you need to do is have three files to install this ROM onto your system. First, you need the ROM file itself, then you need the G applications for Lollipop which is also known as Google applications and then last but not the least you need the Super SU file. Now the links to each and every single file will be in the description of this video so you guys can go ahead and check that out. Now once you have placed the files onto your internal storage go ahead and reboot your device into the recovery mode for which I'm going to use quick boot. Now once you're actually in the recovery of your device, what you need to do is go ahead and take a backup of your device. Now this is actually very very important in my opinion and I cannot stress this enough that you must take a backup of your system before flashing any kind of new ROM. Now this is very important because if anything goes wrong, you can go ahead and restore your device from the backup that you just created. Now I already have a backup of my device so I'm going to go ahead and skip that part. Now once you're actually done with backing up your device, what you need to do is go ahead and tap on wipe here, then go ahead and tap on advanced wipe. And then go ahead and select everything in here except for internal storage which will be Dalva cache, system, data and then cache. Then go ahead and swipe to wipe and then wait for it to complete. Now once you're actually done with wiping your data go back. Then go ahead and tap on install here. Then go to the folder where you actually placed your zip files. Then go ahead and select the ROM file. Tap on add more zips. Then select the G apps, add more zips again, the Super SU, and then go ahead and swipe to confirm flash, and then wait for an approximate of 5 to 10 minutes to let it do its thing. So there you go guys, we are now finally running the latest version of Panoroid Android DOM which is actually based on Android 5.0.2 Lollipop on our Nexus device. And in the first impressions of actually using this ROM, it feels really smooth and snappy, but of course it's still in alpha so there can be some bugs and issues. So if you want to stay up to that and see how well the ROM is actually performing, you can go ahead and follow me on my social media, especially Snapchat, Twitter and Facebook. So that's pretty much it guys, that was how to flash the Panoroid Android drum onto your Nexus 7 2013 or any Nexus device for that matter. If you like this video or if this video was helpful to you, make sure to give it a like rating down below. While you're at it, also make sure to subscribe to the channel as it helps me a lot and also makes you stay connected with all my latest tech content. Also, I'm a real social guy, so make sure to follow me on all my social media networks, the links to which will be in the description of this video. That's been it, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you all later in the next one. Peace.